Hello everyone, this is Minister LT, and it's always a blessing to share another message from my Heavenly Father God. Today's word is, don't slow down or stop from nobody. And the reason why this topic is so important for me today, God has put somebody in a position right now. And that position that God has put you in, He don't want you to stop or slow down from no one because I know that you are in love with your Heavenly Father God. You're in love with Him. And this mission right now, I'm just going to tell you up front, don't stop or slow down from no one because you're going to, you're going to find a lot of bumps and bruises. You're going to go through a lot of different obstacles. But do not stop or slow down from no one. Amen? Amen. And before I get started, I always like to take the time out to give our Heavenly Father God the thanks, the praise, and all the glory. I want to thank you, our Heavenly Father God, for blessing me and all your children today for another beautiful and awesome day today. Thank you for our strength today. Thank you for our health today. Thank you for our hearing and our voice today. I want to thank you because you deserve to be thanked. You deserve to be praised. You deserve to be glorified each and every day, our Heavenly Father God. I want to thank you because you're still on the throne. I want to thank you because, our Heavenly Father God, because you my everything. There's nothing that don't go done without you. I want to thank you for what you've done on that, what you done on Calvary, oh Heavenly Father. I want to thank you because you died on that cross for every last one I sin. No matter what, we have nobody in life. We always have you. For that reason, my dad, I'm going to thank you. I'm going to thank you because you're the same today, yesterday, and forevermore. I'm going to thank you because you deserve to be praised and glorified each and every day. I want to thank you because I am in love with you. There's nothing on this planet called earth that I'm not in love with more. I'm in love with you more, I mean, Father God. For that reason, my dad, I'm going to thank you. Even when I don't have nobody to talk to, or I don't have nobody else to count on, I can always count on you. For that reason, right there, Jesus, I'm saying thank you. Because you are our everything. Amen? Amen. Now we're about to get into this word. And I would love for y'all to turn y'all Bibles to Jeremiah <coughs> chapter 2 and read read from verse 25. That's Jeremiah chapter 2 and we'll read from verse 25. And if you have your Bibles open and ready to receive this word today, shout out amen. Amen. Let's begin. Do not run until your feet are bare and your throat is dry. But you say it, it's no use. I love foreign God and I must go after them. That's right. Do not stop or slow down for no one because you're in love with God. God has put you in this position for a reason. And the same reason why he put you in the position because he knew that you weren't going to stop or slow down for no one. And I don't know who this mess is really concerning to. Because I know it was about me, but I know it's also about somebody else too. And, and the reason why I'm saying that is the same reason when you pray and ask God for whatever it is that you ask for and pray for, he didn't stop and slow down for you, right? So why should you stop and slow down for him? And I'm just going to just break it down to you exactly what I mean. Don't stop or slow down for no one. My wife, she always she always say, that's all you think about is your ministry. You know why I was, why I was think about my ministry? Because this is what God gave me. This is the gift that he blessed me with. For that reason, my dad, I ain't stopping or slowing down for no one. But God, if I have one person looking at God's video each and every day, or a hundred people looking at his video each and every day, I'm not stopping or slowing down for no one because he put me in this predicament. This is what I asked for, this is what I believed in, this is what I'm receiving, and this is what he's going to do for me. For that reason right there, I don't matter who it is. I'm not stopping and slowing down for my wife. I'm not stopping and slowing down for my children. I'm not stopping and slowing down for my job. I'm not stopping and slowing down for nobody because I'm love with Jesus, and I'm going to keep doing what I'm doing. My feet going to be bare. My throat going to be dry. But at the end of the day, I'm not stopping, and I'm not slowing for nobody because I know what my Heavenly Father God has started. I know that he's going to finish and I'm going to keep running to my feet is bare. I'm going to keep running to my throat is dry. And even when my feet is bare and even when my throat is dry, I'm going to still keep doing what I'm supposed to do because I'm not stopping or slowing down for nobody. Now who I'm talking to right now? I know somebody's in the same position, in the same predicament that I am right now. And for this reason right here, y'all, I'm telling you, don't stop or slow down for nobody. You keep going because look how far that you don't came from where you started at. If you can just take a look back and see how far you don't came from where you started at, keep going. Why are you going to stop? 
Why you gotta slow down? You keep going, but God have God opened that door for you yet. You keep going. The reason why God still got you in the game because He trusts you. He know that you ain't gonna stop. He know that you ain't gonna, you're not gonna slow down. That's why He put you in the position that you are in right now. That's why you're in that predicament you are in right now because he know that you're not going to stop and he know that you ain't going to slow down for nobody. And the same thing he telling me, the same thing I'm ministering to y'all right now today. And believe it or not, we all have people who going to come at us like, y'all need to stop. It ain't never going to happen. It ain't never going to work. God would never put you in that position in the first place if it wasn't going to happen. Now would he? So don't listen to the note, to the, to the um, they says. You keep doing your part. Don't stop or slow down for nobody. No matter how many people coming at you. No matter how many people doubting you. But at the end of the day, don't stop or slow down for nobody. I don't care what it is because I know that you are in love with Jesus just like I am in love with Jesus. For that reason right there, I'm not stopping. I'm not slowing down for nobody because I am in love with my Heavenly Father God. I know the same God who put me in this, in this position, he's going to finish the position. Hallelujah. Glory to God. So now, who I'm ministering to today? I know I'm ministering to somebody today out there in the world. I don't know who it is, but I know I am. God has put you in this position for a reason, y'all. So don't stop and slow down for nobody. No matter what's coming at your way, no matter how many storms come at your way, because storms going to come, and that's the real um, test of our faith. Are you going to slow down? Are you going to stop because the door ain't open yet? Are you going to stop and slow down because God had not opened that, provided that door for you yet? Are you going to stop and slow down because what people are saying, not me? Not Minister LT, regardless what people think, regardless what people say, I'm not stopping, I'm not slowing down for nobody because I am in love with Jesus, the same one who blessed me with this gift, the same one who blessed me with this purpose, going to be the same one who's going to open that door for me, no matter how many storms I go to, no matter how many people say this or say this about me, I'm not stopping, I'm not slowing down for nobody, hallelujah, now who am I talking to now? I know this message is containing for somebody out there in this world today. If I'm not stopping, regardless what people might say, regardless what my family might say, regardless what people on my job might say, regardless what my wife say, I'm in hell three and four hours each and every day, regardless what people might think, regardless what people might say, I am not stopping, I am not slowing down for nobody. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. I'm not stopping. I don't want y'all to stop. I don't want you to slow down. If L Mr. LT not stopping and not slowing down, I don't want you to stop and I don't want you to slow down right now in the mighty name of Jesus. I believe and I declare right now somebody's going to keep running to their feet as bell. Somebody's going to keep preaching. Somebody's going to keep doing what they're doing to their throat is dry. And even when God opens the doors, your feet still going to be bell and your throat still going to be dry. You still ain't going to stop because you're in love with Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you. Glory to God. I know nobody ain't going to stop. I know nobody ain't going to quit doing what, they, what God had put them in that position to do. Now, thank you, Jesus. Now, if you receive this word today, I want you to shout out, amen. And I never like to leave my show a broadcast when I leave with a prayer. Can you please pray with me? Lord Jesus, I ask you to come into my life to take over, to guide me, direct me, use me in moments I can build a relationship with you. And I believe right now in the mighty name of Jesus, by y'all praying that simple little prayer, that God is able to work in everything out in y'all life right now. And if you ever want to get in contact with me or leave me a comment, my YouTube channel is Withers.lt, or you can leave me a comment on my Instagram at Latarius Withers. That's L-A-T-A-R-I-U-S Withers. Just remember, don't stop or don't slow down for nobody. It's Minister LT. I love y'all. Y'all stay blessed.